climate proof planning is a serious workshop that uh, we organized in the last few years uh, with the students of Drexel University of Philadelphia and the students of the UR University of Venice, uh, in particular with the students of urban planning. Uh, it's an experimentation in which we try to combine the competence of urban planners developed in Venice with the competence of environmental engineer and hydraulic engineer in particular developed here at the University of Drexel. Together, we've got the technical and the sort of visioning and strategic approaches that are needed to think comprehensively about how cities deal with some of these problems. Uh, so we've been um, comparing case studies and working on applied research projects in both continents. And we've worked in New York City, we've worked in Philadelphia, we've worked in Camden. If the world is going to uh, address the challenges of climate change, we need to start thinking not just across disciplines, but across cultures, across nations, and across regions. And so it's exactly this type of global exchange that, um, that we find so encouraging. I had the great opportunity to visit Venice two years ago and there are many similarities in the environmental challenges between our two cities. The first is stormwater management. And we are trying to use green infrastructure here in Philadelphia to manage our stormwater to reduce combined sewer overflows and also to provide some green jobs and to improve the livability of Philadelphia for the residents and the visitors here. In a planning perspective, adaptation to climate change is an issue that cannot be considered only as environmental. During this type of workshop, students learn to consider in an integrated way different type of benefits like cultural, social and economical that the nature-based solution can provide to the cities and community to become more resilient. different solutions and tools related to local problems and stakeholders. In the future, the cities have to improve their resilience to climate change. To do this, it's important to work with new technology. For example, in this experience, we are working with satellite data to define the vulnerability to it is an urban flooding. In this way, your student and Drexel student can work together to define the best solution to adapt the cities. I decided to participate in this international workshop because I'm interested to learn how a big issue like climate change is faced in a different country.